the, the, the craziest thing is, yeah, these chicks will get breed up and knocked up and have a baby by a waist, man. And I'm thinking, blood, you've let this fool plant a seed in you. I wouldn't even want to be friends with this guy. I wouldn't even want that fool to have my number. I wouldn't even want that fool to stand in my presence. And you dated this guy. You let him breed you up and you replicated this guy. Right, someone said, oh, it's you, Jada. Send all the deadbeat dads. See, this is the thing, yeah? A lot of women talk about, ah, oh, deadbeat dad, deadbeat dad. Blood, you shouldn't have breeding them up in the first place. Now, I'm not saying Jada has got a baby that is a deadbeat. I'm just, I'm just talking about, like, just women in general. Man. I don't want to hear no women complain about deadbeat dads. Why the fuck are you lying down with this guy, blood? Any of you chicks right now that are talking to a man, yeah? This is the way to know whether you, you, you should date a man on a serious thing. I'm not saying you can have sleep with a man or whatever. They choose protection and I'm saying, like, don't get breed up by no man if he don't fit this criteria. It's so simple. Just ask yourself this question right now, yeah? It doesn't matter whether you see this guy as serious or not serious. Yeah? This is a question for the gal in right now, yeah? Ask yourself this question. This guy that you're interested in right now, would you want your son to be an almost complete replica of this guy? Almost be exactly like this guy? If the answer is no, stop talking to him. Stop dating him. Don't get breed up by him. It's as simple as that. Like, you don't need to worry about what degrees he's got or how much money he's got or how many people's lives he's saved. Or what he's... Ask yourself, would you want your son to be like this man? Would you want him to be a carbon copy of this man more, like, for the most part? If the answer is no, stop talking to him. And if you don't have any men in your life or you come across men that you want your son to be like, you need to upgrade yourself, yeah? Because there's a reason why yeah, you keep coming across these deadbeat dads and these waste men and that, yeah? Chicks like Meghan Markle and that and girls that are, you know, up there and that, they don't have this problem with deadbeat dads, bro. They don't. They don't date trash men like that. So these women here yeah, that keep complaining about, oh, the, men, the, the man in my waste man, the man in my waste man and that. Well, why are you attracting waste men? Girls that come from upper class wealthy families don't date waste men. They don't attract waste men. They're not even in spaces to attract waste men. So you've got to look in the mirror. You've got to look at yourself. Yeah? So I don't want to hear these chicken mama, dead beat that, dead beat that. Blood. Waste men are going to exist. Not everyone can be like Jay Wise, yeah? Waste men are going to exist. It's down to the women to filter them out. I'm not saying that men don't take responsibility enough. What I'm trying to say is there's always going to be men that are just waste men. There's always going to be men that are chiefs. Yeah? It's down to the women to filter them out. So I don't want to hear no nonsense about oh, deadbeat men, deadbeat men or whatever, man. Yeah, you are what you, what you attract for the most part. If a chick, oh, if a chick can only date Man who are trapping, man that in and out of jail, man that work shit jobs, man that are not educated. If a girl tells me this is all the sort of guys that she attracts, I know she's not of good quality. There's no way. There's no way. If you are of good quality in that, you will have friends who are good quality, who go to places who are good quality, who know other people and other men who are of good quality, and you will be able to attract that. Because when a woman's truly of good quality in that, even waste men that think they can try it, they will know, you know, I even on this guy on this girl's level or not. Because there's men, yeah, that feel inferior to women. You've heard men say, Oh, I don't think I can date that sort of caliber of woman. Oh, she makes too much money in that. Yeah. There's men that feel inferior to women in that. Yeah. That's that, that that's a way of weeding out the shit and low quality men. Be a high quality woman. Obviously, you're always gonna get some some ways, man, that's gonna try his luck and that. But for the most part, them low quality men and that, they will know their place. Men are not as confident as you think, you know. There's men that see 10 out of 10 girls and then, man, they start stalling. They might not even know how to, uh, how to approach this girl. Because you know? yeah, they know that girl there is out of their league. So don't, 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 don't get it twisted, bro. The, the, the craziest thing is, yeah, these chicks will get breed up and knocked up and have a baby by a waist, man. And I'm thinking, blood, you've let this fool plant a seed in you i wouldn't even want to be friends with this guy i wouldn't even want that fool to have my number i wouldn't even want that fool to stand in my presence and you dated this guy you let him breed you up and you replicated this guy
I wouldn't even want to know him. I wouldn't even want him to phone me. I wouldn't even want to give him an hour of my time. Yeah. To, you get me? To get to know a man on a friend. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me see. Yeah. I'm saying network and connect with people. And these girls actually letting this guy mount them. Trust me. I know someone that knows someone that knows someone. Yeah. They're like, they want me to meet. I'm not interested. The guys are fool. The guys are waste, man. And you actually, someone I know got breeded up by him. Crazy. Crazy. Some of these girls, the guys that they pick. It's funny. The men that these chicks pick. So, so yeah, um, yeah, the men that these chicks pick is completely polar opposite to the guy that their dad will pick for them. Yeah? These girls, they, the sort of guys that their dads would never approve of for a fucking reason. It's just dumb.